It begins with the captain's radio call to the Coast Guard when the Exxon Valdez ran aground 24 years ago off the coast of Alaska. It's the famous song from Paul Simon, The Sound of Silence. Now part of a new TV ad released by Coastal First Nations, the group's aim is to remind British Columbians of this environmental disaster. If we move forward with tankers on the coast of BC, this is what we're subjecting ourselves to. Considered one of the worst environmental disasters caused by humans, more than 40 million liters of oil spilled into the ocean on that day. Coastal First Nations don't want the same thing to happen off the coast of BC. There's actually 30,000 jobs and almost $2 billion in revenue in that region that rely on a healthy ocean. So it's a security issue. The ad is being released just a week after two federal cabinet ministers were in Vancouver announcing new changes to Canadian laws, strengthening the rules around tanker safety, trying to win more support for moving oil up and down the BC coast. We require trained experts with knowledge of the coast to accompany tanker captains on the bridge of the ship while they navigate to open waters. But fears over an oil spill remain. Critics say the proposed Enbridge Northern Gateway pipeline would increase that risk. If the pipeline is approved, it's expected Kitimat would see an increase of around 250 tankers a year. But Enbridge maintains the tankers would operate safely. A first response team will be stationed in Kitimat. Emergency response equipment and trained staff will be set up along the shipping route. Now, as for the new ad from Coastal First Nations, Paul Simon himself apparently gave the okay to use this song for the group's cause. I turn my collar to the it characterizes the feeling that we have uh, for what we would end up with if we had an oil spill. Another move made in this public relations song and dance. People talking without speaking. Ryan Sang, Global News.